Okay, I want to do a quick uh, video demo today. Uh, since yesterday, I've been working on my little six inch mini toms that um, I built to work with the uh, strike multi pad over there. Um, dual zone, I wanted uh, head and rim zones so I can add samples, uh, loops, whatever in with the tracks, you know, when I'm recording or whatever. Uh, so I needed two dual zone piezo piezo pads. Uh, piezo switch pads are not uh, currently uh, compatible with uh, the strike multi pad. But um, what I found out along the way, and others have posted about it, is that the Alesis strike in general is not compatible with uh, other manufacturers' piezo piezo pads. Just not. You'll either get uh, no rim response whatsoever or shady response at best out of them. Anyway, um, so after just installing the standard uh, dual piezo type setup that I usually use if I'm building uh, my ISM6, the same type of sensors for the head and the rim, only just one for these little tiny drums here. When I first put them in, that's exactly the kind of results that I got with mine also. No rim response. Really frustrating, actually. But uh, I decided to go ahead and do a little bit of R&D, and the results are that I have great response now, head and rim, for the strike module and for other modules, uh, pretty much for anything now. And uh, I'm real happy with it. It's working great for me. Unfortunately, I thought that would uh, transfer to my ISM6 system or my other systems, and it really doesn't. It doesn't uh, work on uh, my larger pad with ISM6. I tried, you know, the same mod that I did for the rim piezos on 12-inch uh, snare that I pulled off the kit yesterday. just doesn't work right. So, unfortunately, until Alesis comes up with another algorithm, if they do, um, the only pad that I'm making right now that uh, is compatible is my little 6-inch Mini Toms, and they work great. So, anyway, um, modules are off. I thought I'd do the uh, acoustic noise level. Can't really do it with the mic on the stand, so I'll pull the mic off the stand. Works okay. For drums that are not on the rack, but that's what you get when you got a drum on the rack. So, anyway, they're pretty quiet and uh, they work great. Here's how the acoustic noise goes with them. So that gives you a little idea on uh, the mesh head pads, uh, what the acoustic noise level's like. Very quiet. Don't bother any neighbors around me. Okay, let me turn the modules back on, and we'll do the uh, we'll do the uh, demo of this. The uh, pads are hooked up like this. Uh, I wanted to test it and set up things for both the mimic and the strike, so. Mimics on this, strike on this. 